So let's say you have an online e-commerce store and you want to uh, automate the emails as your customers are buying products or perhaps maybe they're trying to buy something, they've left the cart. Or say you have an online course website and you want that when someone signs up for a uh, course, you send them an email. Basically, you know what I'm getting to. We want to automate emails. So in this video, I'm going to be sharing my email automation software of choice called Fluent CRM. Let's dive in and see how Fluent CRM can do our email automations. And to be honest, if you're an online entrepreneur or you have an online shop, online course business, you are going to love what Fluent CRM does. Let's dive in and let's check it out. So over here, I am on my website. I've gone ahead and installed Fluent CRM and you can see here we have Fluent CRM. When we come over here to the dashboard, uh, pretty much all we see is our main things that are very, very important, which are our list and how it's performing. And because this has uh, WooCommerce installed, it's automatically uh, connected, which means if I start making sales here, the sales are going to be showing over here on sales this month. So the really cool thing about this is straight away, when you install LearnDash, for example, or WooCommerce, it has all the integrations over here on automations. So I'm going to give you two examples, which are very, very powerful. As you can see here, we don't have any automations. So over here on LearnDash, we have a course that I created and I've just called this my new course. So if I want to send an email to my students, let me show you how I can automate that whole process. So what I'm going to do now is I am going to... Um, Come back over here to Fluent CRM and click on automations. And to create an automation, all you have to do is to click here on create new automation. You want to give it a name. So I'm going to say new student. And then over here, you can see we have Learn Dash. So this is where the integration is. So I'm going to click here on Learn Dash. And now I have all these different triggers. So I can actually send an email out based on if someone enrolls on a course, if someone completes a course, if someone completes a lesson, if someone completes a topic and enrolls in a group. So as you can see, I have so many options to play around with. All these here can be different, different emails and different email automations. So what we're going to do for this one here is we're going to come over here to enroll in a course. So I want to send like a welcome email when someone enrolls. So I'm going to select enroll on a course, click on continue. And then my subscription status here is subscribe. That's fine. And then on the conditions here, I can target my course. So here is my course. When you click in this area here, it shows in the drop down. So now I can select it and then I can click on save changes. So there we go. This automation funnel here starts when a new student enrolls on that course, which is called my course, which I showed you over here. So this is where it gets exciting now. So I can start deciding what I need to do. So if I click here on this plus button, I can say, OK, you know what? Let's wait. OK, let's wait about. Let's wait an hour. OK, just give them you know, time to uh, settle in and uh, find out where find where they are. And uh, let's hit save changes. So I'm going to wait an hour and then I'm going to send my first email. So here is where I can send my custom email. So if I click here, I can give this email subject so I can call this welcome or whatever. And then I can start typing all my uh, information here. So I could say hello and uh, I need a first name. So I put an at first name. And as you can see, I can continue adding all my content here. If you haven't noticed, this works like Gutenberg. So it has all your blocks. So you can start adding all your, all your blocks here. If you want to add a paragraph, you can just start typing there. If you need to add a button, you can just click here. You can add a button and you can add your link and the button text over here. So as you can see, this will be your main email here. So I'm going to click here on save changes. We're just going to pretend that this is a complete email. OK, you can also click here on this plus button and do other items. So if you want to apply a tag, you can apply a tag for the student that has signed up on your course. So you can click here on apply tag and then you can um, select the tag. So at the moment, I don't have a tag here. So if I click on this plus button, I can add my new tag. So I can say maybe new student. Click on add. There we go. So now I have my tag. I can hit save changes. So now you may be thinking, Mac, why am I adding all these tags and everything? You know, what, what's, what's the point? So the reason why we're adding these tags is because uh, at some point we would like to send some emails out. So we can now send emails based on tags. So for example, if I come over here to emails or campaigns, I can create my first email here 
and uh, target my email to specific tags. So let's say I want to send emails to people that have completed the course. I can specifically go to that tag and that email will just separate the students based on the actual tag itself. So this will make my emails go to the right times, I mean to the right people at the right time with a specific reason. So as you can see, I can do quite a lot in this automation. Now let me show you another way that you can automate all your sales on your uh, website. Okay, so back over here, what we're going to do now is uh, head over here to WooCommerce. So I'm just going to come over here to products and see if I have any products that I created here. So let's have a look. So yes, I have some products. So I have my new course as a product. I even have course A, but this can also be physical products that you're selling on your website. So I'm going to use you know, the information that I have here so far. Let's go again to uh, Fluent CRM Automations. And this time we're going to make an automation for our store. Okay, so over here, again, I'm going to click here on this plus button. And this time I'm going to go to WooCommerce, but let's give this a name. So let's call this new customer. Okay, so I'm gonna click here on WooCommerce and I'm gonna say a new order. So I want to activate this funnel every time there's a new order. So again, I'm going to come over here and target my uh, product. So let's go with uh, my new course. Okay, so over here we also have purchase type. We can do this for any purchase. And this could be only for first time purchase or second time purchase. So for second time purchase, this could be maybe perhaps a discount that you may want to add here. Okay, so for this new customer here, as soon as they buy this, I am going to send them a thank you email. So now I can come over here to custom email and uh, I can just call this thank you. Okay, and just like what we did before, I can then come over here to my email body and type in all the messages that I need to add in here. And once I've typed in my message, I can hit save changes and pretty much my funnel here is ready. So if you want to see how it's performing, you can click here on stats and this will break down what is happening on this funnel. So these stats can also help you pinpoint where problems are so you can always go in and make some tweaks. And finally, if you're ready to uh, publish this, you can just come over here where it says status, change it from draft to published. So once it's published now, as soon as someone buys a product on your website, they will automatically get that email and you can change things around. So as you can see, this is how you can automate your emails using this email automation software called Fluent CRM. All right, guys, let me know what you guys think about this uh, product. It's in the video description below, by the way. And uh, also, if you purchase it using my affiliate link, you will get access to my marketing automation course, which will teach you how to automate using Fluent CRM. All right, guys, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Take care.